Welcome to another mod installation tutorial for voxel map for Minecraft version 1.12. Right now I'm going to yeah, get a clean version of Minecraft 1.12. I deleted my .minecraft folder just so you can be sure I didn't install the mods before already. So yeah, this is gonna load and that's not a problem, we can just let it go for now. Um, there are two things we're going to need. One is the mod itself, of course, though the voxel map 1.12 file and the other thing is light loader also for Minecraft 1.12. So first off we are going to download the, the light loader and yeah, the links for all the files will be in the description below. So you can go ahead and click 1.12 the snapshot. And we're gonna want to download the oh that's my minecraft being ready right there all right I'm gonna close it up for now so we want to download the installer for uh, yeah for minecraft 1.12 of course and on Windows so just click it right there and it will start right away um, yeah then the other file we'll need is the mod itself we can download it right here from planetminecraft.com and you will be redirected to a yeah to the site for the map itself so we can go ahead and click voxel map for 1.12.0 and we're gonna want to download that file too so right now they are both in my chrome launcher but i want them on my desktop so we can access them easy when we'll need them so i'm just gonna drag both files there um, yeah, we'll not be needing any internet anymore, so we can go ahead and open the lightloaderinstaller.x and yeah, here we can choose for which version, but of course we want 1.12, which is the latest version for Minecraft right now, and just go ahead and click OK, and it says successfully created new profile lightloader 1.12 which is all good. So what we're gonna do right now is open up Minecraft and just launch, oh no, we're not gonna launch the game right away. As you can see right here, it has an edit, an arrow added to, um, yeah, to the play button. And we're gonna click the light loader profile, which will make sure we can have the mods loaded. This will only take a few seconds. All right, so that should just be good. And now we can go ahead and close Minecraft, as you can see right here in the top right, there it says light loader without any mods loaded, which is all good for now. We're gonna implement the mod right now. So just go ahead and close Minecraft and go to your Windows search bar. And then we're going to type in percent sign app data percent sign and right now it will say either percent sign app data percent sign or a folder called roaming but it will both lead you to the same direction. Alright, so right now we are gonna click the dot minecraft folder on top and as you can see a mods folder has been created by installing light loader for successfully. So we just gonna click on the mods folder and go into 1.12 and drag the mod of the voxel map right in there. And that's all we're gonna need to do to install the mod itself. So right now we can close this window and open up Minecraft again to see whether the mod is currently loaded in. Which it should be and it should be working just good but you'll see in a moment. And again, this shouldn't take too long, it's only gonna load the mods in. Alright, I'm going to full screen right now and just gonna create a new world. This doesn't really matter at all. There are no items or anything like that that I need to show, so I won't need to be in creative. Alright, so when you open up your world with the... Uh, yeah, so with this uh, mod firstly installed, it will say... Um, yeah, some of the options, so toggle full screen with X, uh, you can zoom with Z, uh, press M for the options of the minimap, and N to quickly add a waypoint. 
Um, so we're gonna press C right now to hide this message and then I'll just show you a bit of the things you can do. So when you press N you can create a waypoint uh, that you desire so you can just uh, like when you have a home somewhere you can click and make a home and on the minimap in the top right corner you'll see a green dot and yeah you can see it right there when you look to it and I think it has a range of 1000 meters but I'm not quite sure about that that might be able to be uh, changed too but yeah in this way you won't be losing any of your stuff you've built or anything like that and yeah so you can go ahead and uh, try some of that out you can go press M for the world map and this will show you everything where you've been so I can zoom out right now but as you can see I haven't been really much pretty much anywhere so it only shows me the island that I've spawned on and so yeah here you've got a list of your waypoints as you can see this is the one I just created you can edit it too like change the color or you can disable it anything like that you can even yeah change the change where it is but I wouldn't be touching that too much because you might lose the stuff you've created and um, yeah you can sort by 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 name you can sort by distance there are pretty much cool uh, a lot of cool features like that and yeah, that's pretty much it for the installation of this mod. You can go ahead and press C to zoom in on the minimum in the top right corner, as you see right there. So yeah, good luck with the installation. And if you have any problems or need some help or just have any questions, let me know in the comments. And if this video has helped you, please like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks again and goodbye.